Pigmentation correct in top and underline. Um, she has a hoop with a little deep 
very good angle ladies in the front and the rear at the moment unfortunately not in the best hair condition but she showed up very well and had a very good presentation today first place congratulations thank you very much and number 402 this is also a female with a correct size um, with very good pigmentation, also with a, a, a correct top and underline. Comparing to the first one, the group is a little bit short. Uh, the upper arm could be a little more angulated, very well angulated in the rear. But she presented herself very well with powerful drive. Uh, comparing to the first one, the front reach should be a little more free. Thank you very much. Number four or five, I think she was second at the beginning, but she did not present herself so well. Uh, I think the movement could be a little more balanced. She is pacing a lot of time, and at the end of the movement test, the rear drive was not so good anymore. But when she stands in front of me, it's a beautiful female. Maybe she needs uh, uh, to more training for the future. Yeah, uh, she has nice head, good top and underline. Also here the coupe is a little short. Uh, upper arm could be a little more angulated. Correct angulation than the rear. Today, third place, congratulations. Thank you very much. And number four or nine, it's a big female, medium strong, stretched. Uh, with a uh, normal head, this means the head should be a little more pronounced to, in Sir. comparing to the body. Sir. With good top and underlying, good uh, position of group, upper arm should be more angulated, correct re-angulation. Shows good movement, good presentation today, very good. And the next one, four or three. The handler was looking to me many times. But, uh, okay, <laughs> the quality of the dog was not so good to put her up more to the front. Uh, medium size, medium strong, with uh, good proportions, with a good top and underline, the coupe is a little steep, and uh, good angulations, but uh, she was falling on the forehand, and uh, the movement was not so quite good, even the front reach, the, 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 the drive. Uh, you, uh, she could not uh, transmit the power from the rear to by, by her back to the front, so the front reach was not very good and she was falling on the forehand. That's the reason why, but the last very good, thank you very much. Okay, and four or four, also this handler was looking to me, I know he had some good dogs yesterday, but today he took the wrong one. Um, and uh, it's a nice female when she stands in front of me with good head and good top and underline, good position of group with correct angulation. But why this female is not moving well, why she does not present herself very well today, I don't know. But this was absolutely nothing in the movement test today. Good, thank you very much. Breeder Tichi Michela, owner Dr. Pablo Olivares. Second place goes to entry number 402, Ira Von Kaiser. Breeder's name, Attorney Alex Abisado Jr. Owner all the way from Jensen, Philippines, the home of Manny Pacquiao, Jay Ocampo. Third place goes to entry number 405, Bea from Fair Hundred Hertz. Reader Franz Lansing, owner Asuncion El Lerado. Best local born also goes to entry number 402. Congratulations, Mr. J. Ocampo. I hope your trip from Jensen is all worth it. Let's give a big round of applause for our winners. All right, we go now to the 18 to 24 months male. Yeah! 
Ilan buwan? Jani. Jani. Ilan daw? Thank you. 
Lakad lang daw, lakad. Sabi ng Diyos sa atin, walk. Doggy. 
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we have the class 18 to 24 months males. And let me say, it's a small class, but it's a very nice quality. And comparing to other classes, where I really had no chance, at the top here I had a chance for the first and the second, but at least the number 303 uh, made a better job today. And we have a winner, this is the number 303. This is a dog with an absolutely correct size, a strong dog, stretched, but firm and dry, nice head, nice expression, and a very good top and underline, good position of coupe, might be slightly longer, very good angulated in the front and the rear, shows very good movement, very well balanced movement with powerful drive and good front reach. Today, first place, congratulations, thank you very much. The number 302, this is a big dog, medium strong, with very good pigmentation, with a nice head, also nice expression, with good top and underline. Uh, comparing to the first one, the group is short and a little steep, uh, well angulated in the front, very well angulated in the rear, shows good movement, comparing to the first one, the hocks I wish uh, more firm, uh, hocks are not quite good today and the dog, I think it's not his best day for the show um, uh, and he to present himself a little more for the future. Thank you very much. And the third one, 305, it's a big and strong dog, stretched, very nice pigmentation, and uh, he has a normal head. Normal head means, I explained it before in the ring already, comparing to the body, I wish the head a little more pronounced. Uh, with a good top and a little pronounced underline already, uh, he has a good position of coop, which is also a little short, with good angulations and good movement today, third place, very good, thank you very much. And the last one, also a dog with a correct size, stretched, with strong head, strong bones, and good top and underline, but the coop is a little short and steep, upper arm is short, normal angulated in the rear, has a problem with the ears, the ears should be more firm, and for today also very good. Thank you very much. In first place is entry number 303, Lazio Bongodalis. Breeder's name Uday Gianni, and will, will. owner is Augusto Benedicto Santos II. Second place goes to entry number 302, Falcor von Westerfeld. Breeder, Ralph Jurgens. Third place goes to entry number 305, Arco von Haus Elisabeth. Breeder, Friedrich Peter. Owner, Erwin Ayan S. Unafia. And best local born goes to entry number 304, Turbo Bomb Bitwood. Bred and owned by Congressman J.C. Raman Nava of Kimaras. Congratulations to all the winners. We will now break for lunch. I'm working class male. Ruben, 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 where are you, Ruben? Do you want to uh, award it now or maybe after this class? After this class, okay. They requested because... <laughs>
Taylor. The winner in this class will be awarded the Seeker win for this year. You can run. Come back.
Last one, please.
from the import I saved to the front. There and something for eighty thousand, thirty thousand for example. It's very hard for us to get something and somebody to is fit to take it back and some of our singers to pick money to one that can be here. There are some people here who are like that, who are can take care. Wedong, nice joy. Nice joy. <laughs> Oh, 
Kahit pagpasa mo, okay, go! Oh! Select. Uh, I tell you why. 
yesterday, maybe I came too early to this place and I saw this bite work. And this bite work, sorry, on some females, this is not a bite work. When a female is run away 50 meters from the helper, they have to catch her and to bring her back to the helper. And the same happens the second time. And this female is passing. Sorry, I cannot accept this. This is not a bite work, then it's better not to have a bite work on a seagull show. Sorry to say this. This is my meaning and this is also why I decide not to give uh, excellent select. So, okay, you can accept it, you can complain, you can do what you want, um, but uh, this is not a good way to show your dogs at all. Uh, sorry. So, okay, we have a winner. This is 204. A female with the absolute correct size. Medium strong, nice head, nice expression. Oh, she should not kill you. Huh? And she has a nice head, nice expression, and this uh, excellent top and underline. She is very well angulated to the front and the rear, comes uh, and goes uh, correct, and, and uh, she show, presents herself very well and uh, shows very good movement today. So, first place, excellent. Congratulations. Thank you very much. And the two or six. A female which is very close to the first one. I think at the beginning she was first place, but during the movement test she did not show up so well. And in, even when it became fast, she was not the same quality like the, uh, uh, the one in the front. But a very nice female for breeding, I think. Uh, with very nice head, correct top and underline, correct position of group. Maybe I should go away a little bit from the speaker. It, whistles all the time and correct in her angulations in the front and the rear, also correct in coming and going. Uh, today, excellent second place. Thank you very much. So, let me say, this first two females have been a special quality comparing to the rest of the class, even when the others are getting excellent, but the first two have been a little bit better in their structure and in also in um, their presentation. So the next one, I think it's 215, right? It's a big, strong female, a little more than stretched. I will not really say long, but she's firm, she's dry, with good pigmentation, with good top and underline, correct angulation in the front and the rear. The coupe is a little bit short. She presents herself very well. Today, excellent third place. Thank you. And the number four, I think she was one place in front before, but in the movement test, uh, she showed up well, uh, sure, but the problem on this female is a little bit the pigmentation. Uh, I wish her black in the back a little more pronounced. So that's the reason why we came for us today. But a very nice female, big female, strong female, nice head, good top and underline. Today, excellent four. Thank you very much. So, who is the next? Number 216, female with correct size, uh, medium strong, good head, good expression, good top line, the group is short, upper arm should be more angulated, correct angulation in the rear, shows good movement. Maybe she should, would do it a little better in her movement if she would be a little more stretched. I think she is a little bit too short, but also excellent today. The 217 is a big female, I think it's more than the top of the size, with good head, strong head and good top line, a little pronounced in her underline already. The coupe is short, a little steep, the upper arm is also a little steep, should be more angulated. The pastons are not quite firm, but at least she did a good presentation, excellent. And the 212, also a female at the top of the size, medium strong with good head, with good top and underline, short group, short upper arm, and also the hind quarter is normal angulated. But uh, she did a good presentation, excellent. So, and to the 210, 
also a big female, medium strong, with good head, good expression, good mask, and um, good top line. The underline is a little short, the coupe is a little steep and short, uh, good angulated, but, and she shows also good movement, good presentation, excellent. And the last one I told at the beginning already, she did not show up very well. Um, good uh, pigmentation, good head, which is very long and her back lines are not firm. That means at the moment the reserves look flat, the, the coupe is very short, uh, normal angulations. So today, very good. Thank after this, after this, One, two, three, yeah, 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 the we, will, if, we will, I will pass on the mic to Mr. Ben Wego to award the winner in the TSB. Hi. Sir, excuse me. Peter, Peter. Okay, one, two, smile. The dog, you know. Tawag na, tawag na, so tawag. Kita! Yeah. Hey! Tawag, tawag po, tawag. Tawag, tawag. Okay. 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 Okay.